Hello, my name's Kathy Dobash, and this morning I was out on the roads, and uh, the roads were travelable, but I am sure by now, this time, at uh, 1.40 p.m. in the afternoon, the snowstorm is causing many problems for travelers, so I'm glad I'm safe inside my studio located at the historic Markle building in downtown Hazleton and my studio's name is Beauty Flower Home. I am an artist, I'm also politically active and uh, many different candidates ask me to take photos and sometimes I agree when I can and I have the time and right now it's just kinda looking at the Loser and County website and I saw that Renita Fennick posted uh, a lot of my photos. I, I just looked at it today, which was kind of nice. There was a Lincoln Day dinner, um, which I attended. So you can go to the Luzerne County website, uh, luzernegop.org, and uh, look at some of my photographs. So I've been busy with t attending events this past week, taking photos going to my job, announced that I'm running for Luzerne County State Committee. There's my packet. Uh, I was at an event last night for Tara Tuhel. She's running against um, uh, the House Leader and uh, she's running for House of Representative for the 116th Legislative District and her theme is We Deserve Better. So, I was just trying to help with those things, and I'm looking out my window and realizing today's story is about the snowstorm. <laughs> and it is, of course, close to Valentine's Day because I just opened up a card from a friend, which was nice to receive today. I'll have to thank that person. Um, but I wanted to talk about, since it is about the snow today, I want to show you a little bit of a mural I completed with the community of Hazleton. I'm on the first night Hazleton Court Committee, and we completed this mural. I worked on it over a long period of time, but I pulled out some of the sections. There's 12 sections, and it's called First Night First Light. It was a community mural project. I'm going to scan to the back because at this back wall is a piece that hung in the Art of the State show in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania in our State Museum in um, the summer of 2007. So there were two sections to that and that was part of it. But I'm going to scan at pieces that a lot of people haven't really seen, except maybe if you looked at some of my slideshow. And see, it says First Night Community Mural Winter Landscape Project with myself, of course. And the best thing about this was, it was bringing attention to the arts in downtown Hazleton at an annual event. And those people have become very good friends. And I worked with children of all ages, as you can see, represented in this snowman that was completed by a participant through the Hazleton Y after school program. And uh, this was completed by a woman who is young at heart and um, age in her 80s. Isn't that beautiful? So I went to the Hazleton Senior Center downtown and did a workshop too, and I had men and women participate. I conducted workshops prior to the first night Hazleton event and then of course on that night um, anyone who attended the event were, was allowed to participate to contribute and they did many paintings and drawings and I pulled it all together and created this community mural project and there's 12 completed sections and believe it or not I still have saved um, some work because I conducted workshops after the event too so more of the community could participate and there's still pieces I still need to complete for this mural and it is my hope that it will hang 
in the intermodal building which had its ribbon cutting ceremony oh, several weeks ago and that was a grand occasion for the downtown Hazelton area so that's my hope to br bring this to that location to be hung for permanent display for everyone to enjoy so I'm trying to work with the ind individuals involved with that project and um, I'm just showing this beautiful photograph of the Marco building that was taken by a friend Brain. He's a photog uh, Blaine. He's a photographer for the Standard Speaker, and he said it was all right to use his image in this. It was like his contribution to the project, actually. So it's about snow today, and that just reminded me to share my mural, my community mural project, with you because this really is a seasonal piece and it is a very wintry day <laughs> so there's some more of those snowmen another ballerina dancing and the aim of this project was to and I have this figure because she kinda was used in a first night Hazleton project too um, I had her as an inspiration. So there they are. More snowmen. I wonder if children will be making snowmen in the next several days. Do you think so? Snowmen and snow women? I think they will. And hopefully with the trouble all this weather causes, I hope that uh, everyone can stay well and safe. So there was the logo. This uh, was First Night Hazleton 2007. And the final, the workshops for most to participate was held that evening, Christmas, um, New Year's Eve, December 31st, 2006. And I'm just going to give you a little bit more. Oh, there's another. There's a snowflake. There it is. And well, although this is in separate sections, um, there is a plan to hang it. Each piece can, there's a flow to the piece. It goes from first night from a dark type of blues night scene to, to a brighter, lighter feel of light into the morning. So that, that is what I was working for. Okay, I'm going to take everyone outside a little bit to the windows. I might peek out if I'm brave with my camera. I don't want to get it wet in my next vi video to show you what is happening here in downtown Hazleton located in Luzerne County in northeastern Pennsylvania.